Hey kids, it's Dad. It is a Friday afternoon. The Cliffords are getting excited. We're all going to go to the Kalahari this weekend. So it's going to be a Saturday, Sunday, and a Monday on the Lazy River. It's supposed to be kind of rainy outside, hot and rainy. So we're going to be at indoor, outdoor water park. So it'll be kind of fun when it rains, we can come inside. And when it's not raining, we can go outside. Lots of sunscreen, lots of candy, and goofing around. And it's going to be exciting because it's going to be all the Clifford kids, big and little, excited to have everybody come along with us. So if you're in Wisconsin Dells and you want to, and my peeps are down there, you can, no, no. You know my digits, but I'm probably not going to answer. I will answer, but it'll be with, on the Lazy River, sipping a drink. It's going to be so great. Just nothing. What do you got going on today? Nothing. What do you got going on tomorrow? Nothing. What are you going on today? Nothing. Lazy River. That's me. Me and the Lazy River. So that's what's happening. So for today's topic, I want to talk to you about kind of a ritual that my sweetheart and I have. Every night before, I don't know why I'm playing with my ears. I'm like Carol Burnett. Every night before we go to bed, Becky will ask me what I'm what my best part of my day was. I will ask her, I'll say, what was the best part of your day? And usually she says getting away from you or when you leave the house or something, something heartwarming and tender like that. You know, yesterday, the best part of my day was news that I got at night. It was like the last thing I had heard. It was a work-related thing. It was a promotion kind of thing for a, for a, a, a coworker that I have. And I thought to myself, you know, that's just awesome. I mean, like, awesome plus. And, you know, it, it, and I'm just thinking about, you know, how, how great it is to work with this person and how, you know, fortunate it is to spend time with him. And hopefully I'll get to spend more time with him in his new high-rolling big position as he's just, like, flipping hundreds and fifties around. And, you know, because he's got this big promotion. He's a big wheeler now. But all kidding aside, I was, that was the best part of my day is hearing that he was excelling. It's always great to hear when friends do great things. But this guy, he is. He's great. He's phenomenal at what he, what he does. He's very eloquent, but he's, he's certainly down to earth. And, you know, last week we were on a, a conference call and he had a sandwich. His sweetheart brought him a sandwich. He's munching on a sandwich. I thought, okay, that's just awesome. That's awesome. You know, is that, is that, we all work from home, so my sweetheart doesn't bring me sandwiches, though. But I digress. Uh, maybe she does. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what we get out of this. But the fact of the matter is, he had a really, he had great news. And I found out, and it just sent me to the moon. I was so happy for this person, because I can't see anything. Got to be tight-lipped. Mm -hmm. About the promotion. Can't talk about it. So people, you can put me in the you know stretching machine or the thumb screws, but I won't talk. Can't talk. But it's exciting. It's exciting for him. And it's exciting. So the best part of my day was hearing that news. And it's kind of neat to be able to go to bed and think about what was the best part of your day. So what is the best part of your day? Do you take time to be thankful for those, you know, small little nuggets? Those, those little best parts. Uh, kids, be thankful for what you got. And keep... Uh, Keep track of those those things, and maybe someday you'll have a sweetheart, and you'll be able to say, hey, the best part of my day was this. And I'm thankful to my sweetheart who asks me, because it helps me to evaluate and keep perspective. And congratulations to my buddy. That's such good news. I love you, Matt. I love you, Claire. I love you, Tommy. I love you, Emma. And I love you, Drew. I will talk to you later. Bye.